This is the first video I am making and it is going to provide you with a simple half circle arch shape and this shape can be used for a variety of different things. You can use this as a template for floors, um, roofs, I mean you name it and the math behind this can be mixed up with a variety of different other geometrical shapes to form a variety of different shapes for your building and uh, like I said this is the first video I am going to create a playlist put it at the end of the video and I am going to provide you with links to other parts or other videos I have already made and maybe some more videos I will make in the future for how this is actually laid out how the circles are created with a tape measure and how I cut it out with a saw so with that said, let's go ahead and get started. We have a four by eight sheet of plywood here, square edge, and we are going to start with a four foot center point. Center points will be for our circles, so that's something you can remember. This is going to be a four foot radius. Remember the diameter is the distance all the way across, the radius is half of the distance you will draw your circle or your half circle I just kind of I want to throw in whatever I think is going to get you thinking in the right direction so here is the complete circle uh, for some of you if I just drew half the circle in it might be a little confusing but this is a half circle arch after we have drawn our lines we will be able to cut out the shapes with a jigsaw or a skill saw or even a bandsaw depending upon what we are dealing with and you can always use the other shape also so this gives you an idea how you can create a shape for a half circle arch now let's go ahead with our second example the arch is going to be three foot wide here's our eight foot by four foot sheet of plywood and what you're doing right now is just laying out the arch so that you can figure out where everything goes. So you can do this on a scrap piece of plywood. You don't have to do it on a full sheet. Uh, these are just my examples here. So three foot wide and it's going to be 20 inches tall. And the reason for this is so that I can have a two inch space here so that it'll make the arch a little stronger. And again, I'm just throwing out a bunch of different ideas. One foot six, we're going to draw a center line, 18 inches. One foot six is half of 36 inches. So this is the center point. We're going to draw our circle. And you don't need to draw the whole circle. I'm just drawing this in there as a reference. We can see that this is a half circle with a two inch space here, even though it's tight against here. If we wanted to have a one inch or a two inch space on the side then all we would need to do if we wanted a two inch side would be to make this three foot four inches and then center everything and then we have a two inch two inch and a two inch space and of course there's what our arch would look like without the lines one foot eight or uh, 20 inches there's our two inch gap better view of it there our two inch gap here it is after it's been cut out go ahead and zoom in on it three foot two inches and then from here to here would be 18 inches or one foot six inches now I wonder I'm going to try and provide you with the same kind of layout for each individual video but I left this here to give you an idea where the four foot by eight foot sheet of plywood was in proportion to the arch so that is it for the video and I am going to make more videos and I will create a playlist for that that will be at the end of the at the end of each video either that or I will put a little button up here that will say next video and uh, you'll be able to go through all of them or simply go to the playlist and choose which ones you want to watch.